let's extend the concept that we learned in the previous lesson for solving word problems with models. When we solve word problems using models, we will encounter situations where we have three units and we need to convert them into four parts or four units. We'll use the same logic that we used for the previous problem to achieve the same result here. One thing that we need to note here is that look at the size of these two bars here. They are equal. And there is a need to convert this bar, which has already been divided into three parts or three units, into four units. And how can this be done? To do this, let's use a ruler to see how this can be done. First, take a look at the ruler here. It starts from 0 and the length of this bar is up to 12. So each of these are of each of these units are of equal in size. So you can find that here it's 4 centimeters. One unit is 4 centimeter long here. The second unit is again 4 centimeters, so it comes to 8 centimeters. And the third unit is again 4 centimeters, so it comes up to 12 centimeters. How can this be converted or cut into four pieces or four units? One method is here I can divide this into four parts the same as what we saw in the previous section. We are dividing this into four units. And again, the same here. Each of these units will be divided into four units. The third unit, again, we are going to subdivide it into four units. Now, how do we group them? You can easily see from the sizes that you see here. Here you have three units. That is the same size of one unit over here. So if we go ahead and divide this also into three units, for example, Each of these here is being divided into three parts. So you can see this here. We are dividing this again into three parts. Now from the diagram you can see that the unit sizes are equal in here. This is one unit size exactly equal to the unit size here and what actually were we doing here we divided the three units that we had into four parts each resulting in 12 units of a smaller size below we had four parts each had been divided into three parts It is transformed into 12 units below as well and the unit sizes are the same. So what we have eventually done here is that when we converted, we said this is one of the new unit sizes. This is two and this is three and this is four. By cutting 
this bar which was originally cut into three pieces we have transformed it into piece that was cut into four parts one two three and four this concept can be used in transforming three units or regrouping three units into four units.